Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel and welcome back for some more of Dyla's homemaker tips. Today I will be cleaning my downstairs which includes my pantry, my playroom. Um, I haven't been here in a while. My kids are down here usually and I tell them to clean up but they can only clean up so much. So I'm down here to really get in and get all the... Ugh, in case we've never met, my name is Dyla. I do a lot of cleaning tips, cleaning homes, and cleaning the most fastest and efficient way so you can have the most time enjoying and the minimal time of cleaning. So please subscribe, comment, and like. And without further ado, let's get started. It is all over the place. My snacks are in here as well, so my kids come in and out of here, and it's just... Unfortunately, this isn't some type of Pinterest pantry, but it works for me. I usually categorize and that's what I'm going to do today. So keep watching. Working from top to bottom has been an unconditional habit of mine. So I am starting off with the top and organizing all my bake, baking and pastas and everything that I cook with in this area. And I really wish I had a system here, but the best I can do is just sort everything out in categories. So my pasta is in one area, my baking goods are in another area, and that's how this part is organized. Snacks are in this area. I usually like to just open up the boxes and place everything in a bigger box so it's visible for the children. The juice and the s'more makers, mac and cheese all go in this area because this is the area that my kids take their snacks from. Now I'm at the bottom and I put my oils here and all my spices and sauces then i get to the very bottom and that's where my detergents are i am actually i didn't really empty it out completely but i am working in sections in this part so i emptied out the right side then i'm going to place neatly and categorize the detergents here go on to the middle and then end up going to the left as i go i wipe and place back Everything is now visible, neat, organized, categorized, and now I go on to vacuuming the whole downstairs. I start off with top to bottom once again. I am going to take off everything off the couch, vacuum the cushions, vacuum under the cushions, and vacuum under the couch. Finally, I get onto vacuuming the whole house and I usually spray down under the radiators and get everything out from under there and just vacuum everything in sight, make it nice and clean and then I will get on to mopping. But for now, I am just, you know, making everything nice and snazzy, making it pretty, making it clean. If I step barefoot, there's nothing that's sticking onto my feet because that is my biggest pet peeve. I hate when things stick to my feet, so I do vacuum on a regular basis. Now I'm just organizing, neatening up, and calling it a clean with me session.
Thank you so much for watching. Please come back for next week's video. I will see you next time. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment, and like. I will really appreciate you joining me and my YouTube family. Now I'm going to get on to the bathroom, which will be another video. Bye.